Hello, and welcome to Behind the Pipes, a mini-series where we take you behind the scenes of the pipe organ here at First United Methodist Church in Florence, Alabama. I'm your host, Sam Flynn. In today's series finale, we will be giving you a little information about work that's already been done with the organ and where we currently stand in our fundraising project. This summer, the Milnar Organ Company came and did some work on the organ. They took out about 35 to 40 pipes uh, that needed to be repaired. Uh, because of the, the material um, of the pipes, the, the metal, uh, they had started to decay on the bottom of the pipe. Um, and, and so they came and they, they shaved it down and they used duct tape to, to, uh, to, to firm it up so that the pipes could then stand back in the wind chest appropriately as it could. Uh, now, this happened to only 35 or 40 of the pipes. Uh, there are other pipes that this is going to happen to in the future as well. And that's additional work that will need to be done uh, to the organ. As of today, we have approximately $7,165 in the organ fund. Now, we are getting closer and closer to our $12,000 goal to be able to do the repairs that we need to on the instrument right now. Our hope is that we can raise this money by the end of the year so that we can begin the work in January so that the organ's ready for uh, the busy se season of the spring. We're grateful that you joined us for this journey behind the pipes of the 1982 Reuter pipe organ that's here in our sanctuary at Florence First United Methodist Church. If you like what you learned about the organ and are interested in contributing to the organ fund to help us with this project, we invite you to do so by calling the church office or by visiting fumcflow.org slash giving. That's fumcflow.org slash giving. Once again, we'd like to thank you for joining us on this journey. I'm Sam Fleming, Director of Worship and Arts and Organist here at Florence First United Methodist Church, and we hope that you enjoyed going with us behind the pipes. <laughs>